September is Recovery Month, a time to educate and create awareness around substance abuse and recovery. I definitely never thought I would end up with a needle in my arm using heroin. John Koch, Director of Community and Public Relations at CMS, uses his recovery story to give hope to those still struggling. So 95% of people will not recognize that they have an addiction because of the stigma that lies with it. Koch says addiction has no face, and those that suffer often struggle to find help that works. A lot of people have a stigma against it, which is what reduces people from getting into treatment. But at the end of the day, methadone treatment and buprenorphine or suboxone treatment is the best chance we have at fighting this. The great thing about buprenorphine and methadone, they don't give you the high that the illicit drugs do, so that we can get people on those, work with their psychologist over three to six months to help work with triggers and, and with cravings and slowly wean them back off. Our willpower often with addiction and or with a substance use disorder is not enough. And so we need help. We need, you know, to build a group of people that we can support us, that we can go to, that we can talk with. I think this month's very important because I think so many people think there's not hope, there's not a cure that really works for this. Um, I think this month is, gives us a time to talk about the cases in people who have, who have beat their addiction or have worked through it and become sober. I think that's the exciting thing about this month. For those who have dealt with addiction, Recovery Month is a reminder of their progress and hope. What that means to me today is I, I get to be a dad. I get to be a son. I get to be a, uh, you know, a friend. I have a career. Um, you know, it's it brings all these different pieces, right, and it, to my life, and that's all due to recovery. Koch shares a message of hope and encourages those who need help to seek it. In Bozeman, Heaven Van, MTN News.